Hello, it is the 22nd of November 2010, and this is today's uh, silver update. And the market's exceeding again towards the upside. We are reaching this uh, 27 and two thirds area, which happens to be the Fibonacci from this uh, high back in the earlier stages of November and the lows that we set uh, earlier last week. And the 61.8 is 27, two thirds ish or so, and it's holding up really, really nicely at this level right now. Last night, or when the market opened, for most people in North America, that would be Sunday evening, Sunday night, it had a test of the 27.80 level. A few hours later, again, it tested that uh, and then fell back down to 27.20. So we've had a little bit of resistance thus far. That might be all that there is. Maybe we can even come back lower, test this five-day moving average. If that's the case, it would develop uh, an inverted head and shoulders pattern as a possibility. By the time it meets up rising, it would most likely match within this low. But with this resistance that we encountered back uh, in the uh, earlier part of November from its original bounce right in here, it does signify that to be a uh, bigger area. And if we do continue to uh, move higher, there really isn't much resistance, probably mid midway towards these highs. There, there might be a little bit. And I was showing even on the blog the price memory. There's not much price memory in here for the higher level. So to say what areas would be significant resistance and support, like I say, maybe this, the 76.4% uh, area, roughly at 28 and change might be uh, some resistance. But for now, what I would hope is that we do pull back to this uh, five-day moving average. And then from that point there, we can uh, manage to go higher. And what would even be nicer is if the five-day moving average could meet up with this 10-day moving average as well. So thank you for watching and have yourself a great day. Bye-bye.